he's no longer in the quarantine tank. All right, so this would be a, a pretty short update for the Pundamilia nairi, otherwise known as... And um, it also depends on what point that they're pulled from, usually called um, some variation of some point there in Africa, red. Um, she is her very first time being pulled from the tank and her very first time holding uh, eggs. She ate them. No! <laughs> she didn't like it. She got stressed out. Uh, to be expected. Nothing strange about that. Uh, it happens. It's actually very common. Um, hopefully, she'll be holding eggs again soon. So, uh, I just don't want to leave her in the main show tank, her or any of the other two females, as soon as they're holding eggs and it seems like they're fertilized because I want to actually raise the fry. I have two separate tanks set up, two 10 gallons that are cycled. And those two tanks are just so that any holding female can move into them and not be bothered by the rest of the fish. And then also once the fry are free swimming, then I'll separate her into her own quarantine tank and feed her because they go without eating for the entire pregnancy, like two weeks or so. Um, and they get pretty weak, so I don't take a fish directly from the quarantine and put them right back into the show tank because there's a high chance she'll get picked on and she's already in a weakened state. But uh, I'll show the fish. And yes, sadly, uh, no fry. Hopefully next time. As always, <coughs> as always, as always, happy fish keeping, fish keepers, and hopefully we'll have a more positive update soon.